Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hope you're doing well. So, I'm quite nervous because I decided to cut my hair and film it for you. I cut my hair all the time, but there's, I have no technique at all. There's no like special technique that I use. I literally just chop and hope for the best. And sometimes it works. So hopefully it'll work today. So I used to have really long, thick hair and I suddenly got obsessed with the idea of having a bob because I saw it on other people and I've got quite thick hair and really long, thick hair I don't think works that well because it just, well, on me and my hair was quite brittle as well. So it just looked like a lion's mane. It just, it just didn't look very good and it would be like flat on the top and then bush at the bottom. I look back on previous videos and I hate it. So I decided to cut it short and I did. So I, I cut it recently, like up to here. My boyfriend loved it. I don't know if he was just being nice, but I actually really liked it as well. But then obviously I started to miss long hair, started seeing like Instagramming long hair and being like, oh, what have I done? So I decided to grow it out a bit more, but now I'm missing the bob. To cut a long story short, I'm gonna cut it into a bob again. But this time I'm gonna do an A-line effect because before it was just like straight round. Whereas I really like the A-line effect where it's short at the back and longer at the front. But I'm also thinking of putting some blonde in my hair. So this is just the beginning of my hair story. So this is my hair down and now that I put it down now I'm thinking why am I cutting it but I know that I don't I like I don't like it that much I've seen pictures and I'm like ugh yeah so this is it I haven't brushed it yet I right, don't know am I doing the right thing well I'm gonna do it anyway so and I'm gonna go brush it now okay so my hair's all brushed I've taken off my choker because it'll get in the way because it's just a ribbon tied at the back. So yeah, you can see the length is just just below the shoulders and I kind of prefer it to be above the shoulders. I've seen this on YouTube, so I, this isn't in my own, this isn't, <laughs> this isn't my own technique. I've seen other people do this on YouTube. So I'm just gonna hope for the best and do their technique. So from parallel to your ear, I'm gonna take that much hair because this is the bit that I want to keep long. Maybe I should have put it in a natural parting. Oh well, it's too late. So, same again. From the top of the ear. Cute. So I'm gonna brush this bit. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna tie that up in a ponytail. So now, what you have to do is you have to pull the elastic down until it's at the length you want it to be. So I'm actually too scared. It's like quite a lot of hair, yeah. Do you know what, I'm just gonna do it. Right, I'm gonna cut underneath. I can't see what I'm doing. Wish me luck. That's great. Right, I'm gonna have to just look in the mirror and do it now because I can't see. I'm nearly there. Right, I've just noticed loads have come out, so I'm just gonna put it out. Right. Don't know. Don't actually know. Okay, so we've got a few unevenness. Don't worry. Right, so basically just doing the same thing again. Trying to get it all even. How do people do this on their own? Oh, I know, I think they look at a mirror the other side. Why didn't I think of that? I'm such an idiot. I'm just gonna roll with that. Um, okay, 
I'm going to take out the other bits now. Now we just need to make them match. I'm just going to go around the circle. And see what needs doing. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to bra. I'm just going to put my hair into a parting. And then brush. So this needs help. So I'm just going to cut. in that direction to try and get this A-line effect I don't know whether to keep the front bit that long I'm going to cut it a little bit I think so you can probably see more than me like what is going on there right I'm going to sort that bit out in a minute because I'm pretty sure that needs do you know what I'm just going to cut it Basically, what looks too long is too long, so just cut it off. I need to do the same on the other side now. All I'm doing now really is just chopping off little randomy bits that I'm seeing. It's not exactly what I was imagining. I was imagining a bit, maybe a bit shorter at the back. But that's just a start. I might keep going. I think it looks alright. I don't really know what it looks like at the back. If it looks hilarious, I'll put a funny face. So what I'm going to do is go in the shower and then after that I'll see how it looks because you know when you you can kind of only tell once it's been washed what the situation is. My mum's shouting downstairs. I hope you can, really hope you can hear her. But yeah. Hi guys. Sorry about the lighting. It's um, getting quite dark now so I might look a bit bluey. But this is the end result. So I had a shower. And while it was wet, I kind of just brushed the sides like that and then just like made it so it was straight, like a diagonal straight line, let it dry and this is what it looks like. I'm quite happy with that actually. It's definitely different. I mean, you might not be able to tell, but it's definitely shorter. It's got more bounce got more volume but it's still a little bit wet so it's not gonna show exactly what it's like but look I can you can wear this hairstyle in so many different ways like so yeah thanks so much for watching um let me know what you think sorry hairdressers sorry professionals um you probably would have hated that but that's how I do it I just you know I just go for it so give it a try if you want actually I'm not going to give it any advice in case it goes wrong and you blame me but that's just how I do it so yeah thanks for watching see you soon bye